Hello everyone, I'm Wilson. Welcome to the channel. Today, I'm going to show you how you can customize your Windows 11 taskbar. I'm going to show you how you can pin and unpin apps from your taskbar, how you can move the position of your taskbar icons to the left or center, how to hide or show some Windows default icons on your taskbar and much more. So without further ado, let's dive into it. To pin an application to the taskbar, what we have to do is click on Windows Start, then click here where we have All to show all the applications installed on your computer. In this case, for this example, I'm going to use the Brave browser, which is this one here. But if you know the name of the application, you can also type the name of the application right here at the search bar. In this case, I'm going to type Brave right here. I have the Brave application. And then to pin, what I have to do is move the cursor next to the application. Mine is already here next to it. Right click and then click pin to taskbar. As you can see, the application was added to the taskbar down here. To remove the application from the taskbar, what we have to do is move the cursor over the application's icon, then right click and click unpin from taskbar the application's icon will be removed from the taskbar. You may have noticed that Windows comes with a lot of default icons on the taskbar. To remove them, click on Windows Start, then using your keyboard type settings. Click on this first result option where you have settings and then system below. Then click on personalization on the left side. And right here inside personalization, look for taskbar, which is down here. Once you find it, click on it. Because we want to hide some Windows default icons, we are going to work under taskbar items. In this case, I have three icons. I have search, task view, and widgets. Down here, you can see that I have search, task view, and on the right side, I have the widgets. To hide the search, on the right side, I'm going to click on this small arrow and then select hide. And you will see down here that the search icon will disappear from the task bar. If I want to hide the task view, I can do the same right here on the right side where I have this toggle. I'm going to click to turn it off. It will hide the task view and I can do the same thing for the widgets. I'm going to click again to turn it off and it will hide the widgets icon. If you want the task view on right here on this toggle, tap again to turn it on and the task view icon will appear down here on the taskbar. This is how you can hide or show Windows default icons on the taskbar. Move the position of the taskbar icons. To change the position of the taskbar icons, we're still going to work here under the taskbar settings. Click down here where we have taskbar behaviors and then the first option that we have here is taskbar alignment. On the right side, you can see that mine is set to left. So all my apps icons are aligned to the left side of my screen. If I click on this small arrow and then select center, you will see that all my icons will be aligned to the center of my screen. I'm going to set back this to the left because this is how I like my icons to be shown on my screen. We also have a lot of other options down here, but I'm going to point to this one here, which is the second one where we have automatically hide the taskbar. If you tick this, it will hide your taskbar. If you move your cursor to the bottom of your screen, your taskbar will appear. And if you move out, your taskbar will disappear. I like my taskbar visible all the time. So I'm going to tap again here to unselect so that my taskbar is visible all the time. Hide or show default system tray icons. The system tray is on the right side of your taskbar. We are going to customize it still under the taskbar section. Here, let's work under the system tray icons. If you don't see these options that I have down here under the system tray icon, that means that you have to expand your system tray options. Sometimes it might be like this. And for you to expand, what you have to do is just click on this bar to show you all the options available under the system tray icons. Down here, I have two options, pan menu and touch keyboard. I've never used pan here, so I'm going to click here on the right side where I have on. I'm going to click here to toggle this off 
and then down here I have touch keyboard which on the right side you can see that it is set to always show and down here on my system tray you can see that I have this touch keyboard icon if I click here it will bring this virtual keyboard that I don't use so I'm gonna close it and right here where I have always I'm gonna click on this small arrow and set to never so this touch keyboard will disappear from my system icon other system tray icons as you can see there are a lot of icons on the system tray let me show you how you can remove these icons still on the taskbar section click here where we have other system tray icons once you click it will expand the other way to expand will be clicking here on this arrow you can click to expand and click again to collapse in this case let's click to expand it here we have all the visible and hidden apps on the system tray. To remove an icon from the system tray, what we can do is find the application that we want to remove the icon from the system tray. In this case, for this example, I'll use this one, USB safely remove, which the icon is this small arrow down here. And to remove it, on the right side where I have this toggle set on, I'm going to click here. To set it off and you will see that the icon disappears from the system tray now we have not deleted the icon only remove it from the system tray if you want to see the icon what we can do here is click on this small arrow down here and will bring all the hidden icons from our system tray and right here you can see the usb self remove icon if we want to hide this arrow here what we can do is come up here next to the hidden icon menu toggle this option off and you will see that the arrow will disappear from the system tray. If you want to remove more apps from the system tray, what you can do is just find the app and then toggle this option off. As you turn this option off, you will see that the icons disappears from the system tray. If you want to bring these icons back, what you can do is toggle this option on again and the icons will come back to the system tray. Well everyone, this is how you customize your Windows 11 taskbar. If you found this video valuable, don't forget like it, share it and subscribe to the channel. I'll see you in the next video. Have a good day.